Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. What is the plot or story of Oedipus Rex? Follow this concept map. I have made 13 points. What is the sequence of events in this play? Number 1. Ruined masses of unfortunate city of Thebes consisted of some old trees gather in front of the king at Oedipus Palace. They complain and describe the sufferings of people and miserable condition of the city. Number two, Oedipus himself steps forward to listen to their voice. Their Oedipus sense of responsibility and love for his message is revealed. Number three, after listening to the people, he informs the elderly priest that is not unaware of the sufferings of his people. He already has sent Creon towards Delphi. Delphi, the sacred place. Number four, Creon comes with an indirect answer that the late King Laius murderer must be punished after that the city can be saved from calamity. Number five, on the suggestion of Creon, Oedipus meets with a seer, Frisia. Here, Oedipus includes himself in the declaration that was made for the capture of the murderer. But Frisia reveals the truth that Oedipus is the same murderer whom he is searching. So, both exchange hot words due to mocking and making fun of Frisia's blindness. Oedipus is cursed by Tricias that one day Oedipus would be blind. Number six. Oedipus' controversial speech with Tricias reveals his real character as his proudness and rudeness towards a blind person, and his blame on Creon reveals his suspicious nature. Number seven. Jocasta is endeared to make both Oedipus and Creon understand that quarrel will make the matters worse. Number eight, the messenger from Corinth comes with the news of King Polybus' death. Where first Oedipus, then Jocasta make fun of the oracle. Especially Jocasta cites how she had to lose her child due to oracle. Number nine. Late King Laius Messenger is also called out when the Corinthian Messenger informed that the child was given by Laius Shepherd. Number 10. Now truth is as clear as day. Number 11. As a result, after knowing the truth, Jocasta commits suicide. And Oedipus made himself blind and helpless. Number 13, here I'm describing Coleridge's point of view. Coleridge plays the plot of this play among one of the best constructed plots of the world. Thank you.